In this tutorial, we will see that how you can use vTransfer to send files in just few Z steps. So let's dive right in. For the first step, open up your browser and simply search for vTransfer website. Here it is. Open it. Accept its cookies if you want. Then you will see a dashboard like this. Click I agree if you are. And from here, to send files, simply you can open your Windows Explorer. Then open the folder where you have files to upload. Here it is. Right click on that file that you want to upload and compress it to zip file. It will help to reduce its size. After converting into zip file, open vTransfer and click on this add files open the folder here it is select it and open it you can see here one item selected now here we have to type the email where we are sending this file in second section we have to type our own email you can change its title if you want you can also type a message here along with your file if you click on these three dots you will find some of more options like appearance price expiry and you can also set password for it after doing this all settings if you click on that transfer it will ask you to write a code that they sent to your given gmail open your gmail copy code and paste it here then click Click verify and send. Then you will see a window like this transferring one file to one person. It will take some time according to your file size. After uploading, you will see this type of dashboard. If I open my second Gmail and open my inbox, you can see here it's showing me this email from vTransfer. And you can get our files by just clicking on it. Here it is. We can simply download it by just clicking on download button. So that's how we can use vTransfer to send files in just few steps.